What's up gamers, it's me Alistair from Game Crusher TV and it's my first time playing Go Home Dinosaurs by Firehose Games. So, uh, my first time playing series means I have not played this game before. I haven't even clicked this play but play game button. I haven't even done that. So I have absolutely no idea what I'm getting myself into. It looks a little bit crazy because there's all kinds of animals like groundhogs or something like that trying to get the dinosaurs to go away. I think that's what it's about. Looks like he's trying to have a barbecue. So anyway, let's try it out and see what it, see what this is. Delicious steak. Yep. Call in the Marines. Defend your barbecue. Alright. So, okay, tower defense. Don't let the dinos reach. Okay, so click to move here. Alright, so what do I do? Alright, I just throw rocks at him. That's pretty cool. I kind of feel sorry for the dinosaur. Like, she looks kind of cute. <laughs> Click to take a card. Little pink dinosaur. I'll take the middle one. Place it here. Wait, do I place it here or do I place it? Ah, okay. <laughs> Alright, that makes sense. Something tells me that dinosaurs were not that adorable, like, back 5,000 years ago, or whenever they existed. Hundreds of millions of years ago. Click to take a card. I feel like I'm in a tutorial. Oh, no. Looks like you don't have enough coconuts. Damn it! Grab those coconuts to place more cards. All right. Alright, three coconuts, take a card. And I place it here. Alright, I want to go back over here. Because I like to throw rocks at things! Oh, more coconuts. One, two, three. Dinosaur killed. Kill them pink dinosaurs. And I got a treasure chest. Cool. What is in there? I got a snowflake sentry. It slows it down. Cool. Mmm, barbecue. No barbecue is complete without beer, though. So, what's this? Okay. On to the next level. Alright, so let's harvest some cocoa nuts. One. Two, three. All right. I'll put that here. Okay, I can rotate. Ah, uh, there we go. Allow me to break the ice. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of cute. Someone will make a game about this day. <laughs> yourself. Win the 
Self-actualization in video games. Let's see if we can't kill these guys. <clears throat> uh oh. They're stacking up pretty quickly. One more hit. Come on. There we go. Yeah, you got a treasure. Plus one card! What does that do? Hand size upgrade. You used to have three cards, now you have four. Okay, so I guess I could have up to four towers now. There we go. As long as I keep getting coconuts. Yummy! I always thought that groundhogs were like... Herbivores. Since when do they start eating meat? Hmm. This is a bit strange. Alright, next level. Uh oh. PD Pterodactyl. Flies at medium speed, invented flight on purpose, invented landing by accident. Okay. So he is going to be an air creature. Be a bit more difficult to slow down, maybe? Alright, so let's collect some. Cocoa nuts. Alright, I'm gonna slow down. Maybe go like this here? Yeah, that makes sense. Alright. Alright, they can't take a lot of damage, these pterodactyls. Alright, let's harvest this. And get back here. So I guess the coconuts just happen at random. I guess I don't have to do anything to make them show up, which is good. Oh no. Hey, so throw rocks at him. Come on. Dropping the ball. There we go. So maybe I put another freeze uh, tower there. No business like small business. Grab me some more coconuts. Tell you off what. Need one more. And then put that here. There, that's what I'm talking about. This is what I call a well-oiled machine. Although I am out of cards. And I think that's the end of the level. Okay. Ha ha ha. Got me treasure. Gopher. Oh, they're gophers, not groundhogs. Okay. There's a laser in one direction that hits all dinos in its path. Okay, so I played enough tower defense games that I know that I want that at the end of the entrance way. Man, this guy is gonna eat three steaks every day. He's gonna be one fat gopher. Alright, so... I... yes, exactly. What? Okay, there's a right way and a wrong way. Okay, cool. Let's collect me some... some of these guys. So I want... Oh, 
Oh, you want it to go that way. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Alright, I'm gonna put you here. Oh, I got me some coins! Alright, I'm gonna put the next one of these here. Alright, and I think if I put a, a freezing ray right there, these guys will be going too slowly to escape the wrath of my laser. Mini me. Stop humping the laser. Why don't you and the laser get a frickin' room? Oh, uh, maybe I'll put the... Yeah, that makes the most amount of sense. <clears throat> oh man, I didn't even get to try all my cool things. Getting me some coins here. No. Three more stakes. Alright, let's do one more. Compy, see compy. Weak, numerous, and swarming. Fondly, frighteningly known as the adorable land piranha. All the creatures in this are adorable, though. Alright, so. <clears throat> Choose your cards for the next level. Alright, so. Based on this level, I get a long straightaway, so I definitely want one of these. And you gotta have a freezy thing. And, you know what, I could use another one of these, and, one of these? You know what, better to keep with this. Because I can always slow them down, I can always throw rocks at them. Alright, let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Laser. Oh no! Alright, well that's fine. Alright, so let's put a freezy thingy here. I'll put another freezy thing here. And I'm all right. Nobody worry about me. Well, my last laser is kind of a waste of resources because I can't put it here, which is where I would have put it. Hmm. I can't say I really know what to say. I gonna put this? I guess I'll put it here. <clears throat> I'm not too worried about this, to be honest. My lasers are making quick work of this, and this guy's gonna slow them all down. There we go. What did I win? Plus one card! I like the plus one card, I think that's a pretty good thing. Uh, 
My groundhog gopher is getting morbidly obese. He's had 15 steaks now. <laughs> and he's still just as excited about the last three as he was for the first. Alright. So I only have these guys. I wish I could see... Oh, can I... Ah, there we go. I can actually see the details of my map. Alright, so I can get two lasers here. Is they're going to start here, going to come all the way around. And come here. And I'll put my first laser there. I'll put my second laser there. So get them, get them twice. And right in between, I'm going to put a freezy beam. And then pretty much, pretty much everything else will be incidental. So one, two, three. Put another freezy beam somewhere. And I'll grab one of those. Okay. Oops. That's what I meant to do. Okay. All right, let's harvest some nuts. Yes, yes, man. <laughs> yes. Right, back here we go. So first lazy laser beam is gonna go here. Batteries charged. Laser is good. Freezy beam is gonna go here. No, that's not what I meant to do. Crap! But what I could do, I could put this freezy beam here. I could put my other laser there and just absolutely slam them in the middle. I mean, they ain't gonna have a chance. Alright, you go like this. We're gonna send you over here. And then you put you over here. All the work is gonna happen right in the middle. Like, this is not even funny how much damage this is doing. Alright, I'm gonna put this here just as I like salt on the wound I see on the cake. That was efficient. That was well done. That's a perfect solution to a perfect problem. Whoa! I'm rich! Well done! Good show! Oops. Well, there you have it. Go home, dinosaurs. Wrath of the Hungry Gopher. This is a cute little game. It's available on Steam for $10. And, yeah, it's kind of fun. Good little time waster. Something tells me that, I don't know, maybe this started off as like an iOS or an Android game. I mean, it certainly plays like one. This could definitely be done on a tablet. I don't know if that's where it came from or not, but I mean, it's on the PC now. And it's kind of fun. A little nonchalant uh, time waster, as tower defense games have a tendency to be. And very adorable. They're all adorable. All these little creatures are absolutely adorable. So thanks a lot for watching. My name is Alistair VFR. You can follow me on Twitter at AlistairVFR. You can subscribe to this channel for more videos like this one. And also check out Game Crusher TV. Uh, you can check out our website and we have a YouTube channel. Also Facebook or Twitter.com slash Game Crusher TV to get more news and information from us there. So thanks again for watching. Have yourselves a great day or night or afternoon or morning or whatever it is. Have a good one. Take care.